So to make the peanut butter pie, you will need one package of cream cheese, three fourths cup confection sugar. I made my own powdered sugar. So if you would like to know how to do that, check out the video in the description box below. You also need a half a cup of peanut butter, six tablespoons of milk, one carton of frozen whipped topping, one graham cracker crust, and that will be all the ingredients you need to make this pie. So now we are going to be adding one whole stick of cream cheese into our bowl here. It's a little tough to come out. We're going to give this a mix until it is fluffy. We are going to be adding our sugar and our peanut butter into our mixture here. And don't forget that the recipe is in the description box below if you would like to check that out. And let's add the peanut butter, the best part, into our mixture here. I want to try to get everything out. So now we are going to give all of these ingredients a mix until it is well combined. Now we are going to be adding up to six tablespoons of milk. So let's start by adding just a few tablespoons here and we will go from there. This is one, two, and three. Let's give this a mix first to see if we need to add more. And if we need to, we can always add more. So we're going to be adding another three tablespoons of milk and this will help make the pie super creamy. And then just one more. And this should be perfect. And let's give it a final mix. We are going to fold in our whipped topping into our mixture. And I am so excited for this part. It looks so creamy. Let's just fold this in. And doesn't that look so good already? If you love peanut butter, you're going to definitely have to try this pie. It is one of my favorites, and I hope it becomes one of your favorites too. So just wanna continue just to fold this in until everything is together. And then we will pop this in the graham cracker crust soon once everything comes together. Mixture into our pie crust here. This looks so good already. I cannot wait to finally try this. So once you have gotten almost everything out of the bowl, just take your spatula and just smooth out the top. And, and then we're going to let this sit in the refrigerator either overnight or just for a couple hours until it is ready to serve. So now we are going to do the long awaited taste test. I'm so excited to try this. It is finally chilled in the fridge for a couple hours. So let's give it a try. It already looks so good and so creamy look at that that looks amazing let's give it a try mm, that is so good it tastes amazing the peanut butter flavor is outstanding if you love peanut butter you have to give this a try it's just so light and creamy mm, so good and the recipe is in the description box below and i'm going to be enjoying this now 
and I hope you'll make this and give it a try because this is the best peanut butter pie ever. Super easy to make and the results are great. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you will give this peanut butter pie a try. It is one of my absolute favorite desserts and I hope you will give it a try. Leave a comment down below if you do and make sure to subscribe down below. We are so close to 500 subscribers. So if you could please subscribe, that would be amazing. And make sure to give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.